a center fin into a universal fin box, as well as side bites for future. Let's start with the center fin. Now for the tower hard boards, they're gonna come with the, the screw and the base plate are gonna be in the fin box already. So if you notice right here, there's, there's no screw there. Don't worry about it, it's right here. First thing you're gonna do is take out the screw and this is gonna be with a Phillips screwdriver. And now you, you can see in there the fin plate or the base plate and you're gonna leave that in there. The way you set it in is that it's got this channel guide right here, this pin. This goes down in the center right here and then you're gonna to have to scoot it back and then get the fin all the way down in there. Now, I use the screwdriver to line up the base plate so that I can easily put this screw down in there. I want it fairly snug and there you go. Now let's do the side fins. So the side fins, you're gonna need a, a fin key and if you get fins from us, it'll come with this fin key. Technically, it's an Allen wrench. These fins are gonna have a notch right here in the back. Each fin is gonna have, on this side, it's flat, a flat surface, and that's the side you want on the inside. For the side fins, the outside is gonna be beveled. So this one's the right one, because the flat side would go here. Obviously, they go this way. Don't put your fins in that way. So you put the back in first, and you put the notch in there. Sometimes, when you get the fin box, the screw in here, it won't go in. So you have to make sure that this is gonna sit flush. So on this one, we're gonna have to back out the screw with the fin key, push it in again. See how it's flush right there? That fin is flush with the, the fin box. And then screw this down. You don't wanna over tighten the side fins with the fin key, what happens is that you'll strip it and then it's a real pain to try and get out. The next one, flat on the inside. That's it. You got your fins in and you're ready to go.